from this week. Welcome back to Toledo's only live local 9 a.m. show. Right now would be a good time to get your ticket as less than 100 remain for the upcoming Victory Center luncheon and fashion show. Kimberly Newman is here and now is the time to hurry. But first, we wanted to say congratulations. Kimberly oh. got married over the weekend. Thank you so much, Amanda. Yeah, it's been a long time coming. For anyone who knows, Josh and I have been engaged for what feels like forever now. Um, yeah, but we are officially husband Yay! and wife. So thank you. You're so sweet to congratulate us. And we do actually have a wedding with celebration and, and all the planning coming together uh, in June. So still something to look forward to there. So husband and wife, but for pandemic sake, right? Uh, having to move the big party a little bit later, but uh, still so very excited for you. And we're excited about the big event coming up in two weeks that's going to help folks at the Victory Center. Absolutely, Amanda. So this is really exciting. Uh, speaking of planning, right? Yes. The <laughs> luncheon and fashion show is timeless and teal. We're going to throw it back with some great classic music. Our models on the runway are going to be uh, strutting their stuff, wearing fashions from many of our local boutiques, including Regaza, Atlas Bridal throws in some gorgeous gowns. We got the guys on the runway in their texas and suits, and the kids are going to be up there as well. It's always fun. Um, huge energy in the room, and we love that folks really want to get together to celebrate our cancer survivors this year we have a really special woman who's going to be our uh, featured model and our speaker she's uh she's going to talk a little bit about her journey and for anyone who's curious about what the victory center does this is the perfect event that gives you the opportunity to le learn more about us i think a lot of people are excited to get out and get to a luncheon and go to an event again and so this is going to be the uh, perfect opportunity for you to get back into the swing of things um uh, hopefully we will be able to continue Continue with these events going forward now. Um, but, but Kimberly, as you mentioned, a good opportunity for people to learn more about the Victory Center. Uh, you guys do some amazing work there to help uh, survivors and patients who are dealing with some really difficult diagnoses. Yeah, absolutely. One of the most special parts of the fashion show is the model meet and greet that we host every year. It's for the survivor models exclusively. We get together, we have some good food, and everyone goes around in a circle and kind of tells their story, their journey. Um, I felt honored to be in the room, honestly, that evening. It was something that um, opens up a lot of the vulnerability surrounding folks who are going through their own cancer journey. And certainly there's a lot of fun involved in this event, but it's also one of those things that reminds you uh, what it's all about. You know, the importance of health and family and love and togetherness. And uh, yeah, for the first time in two years, we mm -hmm. finally get to be back together in this ballroom. Uh, we're gonna do so as safely as possible. We're spreading things out. So if you're familiar with the event, it tends to get a little congested in the lobby area so the Hilton Garden Inn has been awesome about accommodating uh, our raffle baskets I got a couple behind me here and and really just allowing folks to sort of explore the space while feeling safe and comfortable uh, back in a gathering setting yeah and you mentioned the raffles and there's a chance to to go home with some pretty great things uh, so you can get something for yourself too <laughs> yeah, absolutely. We don't want anyone to leave empty handed. So as you just saw, we have a timeless tea, which is our signature drink. So if you grab that cocktail, uh, it is a luncheon after all. Uh, you'll actually be donating $1 from every drink purchased back to the Victory Center. Uh, it's going to be delicious. We've got Malibu, Blue Curacao, and pineapple juice. Mm. It's 5 o'clock somewhere, right, Amanda? <laughs> yes, come on. Yes, you're going to come out with your, with your friends and celebrate fashion and, you know, and survivors. Uh, you may as well have a cocktail while you're at it. Absolutely. Uh, <laughs> so the prizes you mentioned, I think, are just really uh, showstoppers this year. The event is presented by Mercy Health, and we also have a lot of folks who've been supporting us along the way. Uh, Bart's Viviano is putting together beautiful centerpieces that you can take home uh, for a purchase price. We also have a cruise that was donated. So if you want to get away from this cold weather for just a $20 ticket, uh, you can buy a big ticket raffle uh, ticket, and you can actually get a $2,500 value cruise to the Caribbean. And who doesn't want that? Mm -hmm. uh, we also have a generous prize donated by Jay Foster Jewelers. That's the gorgeous bracelet you see here. Uh, blue topaz and diamonds. Um, I may be trying to win that yeah, one myself. Yeah, that's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I think it would go and with my really necklace. Show you this because if this was a labor of love, the bows, the boxes, everything <laughs> donated by Jane Worth at Regaza. And inside each one of these mystery boxes is a pair of earrings. Uh, so $20 for a mystery pair of earrings. We're going to do a full on. Three, two, one, everyone opens and reveals. And one person, Amanda, is going to have a genuine diamond pair of earrings from Carol Jaffe. For $20. So that's special. Wow. Yeah, really 
them. Wow, it's going to be... Like, 99% discount on those yeah. earrings, so wow. you can't lose. Yeah, you really can't lose because you're still going to get something cute either way. Um, but we got to get your ticket because you're running out, so how can people get theirs? Okay, it's a phone call. Nice and simple. The phone number is 419-531-7600. Thank you. Yes, right there at the bottom. <laughs> Jot and, it down. Um, <laughs> Just tell us how many tickets you want. If you have someone specific that you want to sit with, uh, tickets are extremely limited at this point. And most importantly, we're honoring our survivors. So if you are a survivor, you get to stop at the survivor table. You get a teal ribbon because we're timeless in teal this year. And uh, we really are trying to acknowledge how big of a community that is and the fight that you all have gone through as survivors. So it's a celebration, Amanda. And I can't wait. We're less than two weeks away. Yeah, yeah March 4th is coming up here in a couple of weeks. We're going to be into March. March, thankfully. <laughs> no, right. Kimberly, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thanks, Amanda. You bet. Take care. Well, thank you. For